crypto. Take me home. Today, I'm going to share with you some new updates. Sonode Video App has improved its 3D camera tracker property by adding the mask option. The masking allows you to manually select the area in your footage to which you want to apply 3D camera tracking. Below are other options that can be used to manually track your object using keyframes property. You can also control your mask shape by adjusting its center, which allows you to move it left and right, and the scale, which also allows you to increase and reduce the size of the shape, and as well as the rotation, allow you to rotate the mask shape. Lastly, the invert option allow you to reverse or switch the masked area. The red color represents the areas that won't be tracked, while the green color shows the areas that will be tracked. Now that you know all about these functions, let's run a simple test to see how it works. So I'll select the object here, using the rectangle mask. The higher the resolution, the more accurate your tracking will be. So I'll select the 1080p resolution, and I'll leave the frame at its default settings without changing it. Now, I click on the Analyze button. So currently this update can be a bit laggy, so you may sometimes experience tracking errors. Now that it's done solving the camera data, as you can see the tracking data appeared only on the selected masked area. So I'd like to create a scene where Superman appears to be shot with kryptonite, and I will try to achieve it using the lens flare effect. The threshold controls the visibility of the tracked points. So I'll continue by compositing an object to the selected track point. I'll remove the black screen of the lens flare by going to the material options and reducing the opacity of the pre-multiplied transparency to 0.5. Now that we've got all that set up, here's a playback review of the work we've done. To learn more and master 3D camera tracking, below you'll find a link where we covered everything you need to know about Node Video 3D camera tracking. As always we appreciate your incredible support, if you find this video helpful, please kindly give it a like button, and until next time, peace.